What is up guys, Zane here. Uh, I'm starting up a single player world and I think I'm going to do a let's play on it and this is one of my first videos as a vanilla player. Normally I play servers and stuff but we're going to go ahead and get started. And basically today what we're going to do is it's just going to be a short episode we're going to look for some place to build and we actually spawned right here and right behind us we got this cool uh cool generation so let's go take a look at it it uh it's kind of got like an arch to it so uh the only problem with something like this is I'm not very good with building in uh, like kind of arched areas and uh, hold on let me change something real quick sorry I had my game all the way up so I could see like uh, on the servers that I I'm normally play on servers like faction servers that uh you know, you don't really want to focus on torches, so if you go into the Minecraft options and turn up your gamma, uh, you don't have to use torches, but I'm already out of food. But uh, we were looking over there, but th it's a little dark over there, so we'll look over there later. But um, we're just going to explore a little bit today and see what we can find, maybe a place to build. Uh, I guess we'll go ahead and get some wood to make some basic basic tools um this is a 1.7 generated world and uh i've looked a little bit at the 1.7 generation i it's looks pretty nice but uh it's like so i'd like to build maybe in like one of the savannas but you know this is kind of catching my eye over there that looks really cool but um if we could find a place to build this episode, we'd be on track. But if we can't, I'll probably just... Why am I making a boat? <laughs> but I'd probably just kind of go off on my own and uh, find a little place and then come back to you guys. So we're going to go ahead and get some stone here to make some tools. But basically what my plan is for this series is uh, we're going to do maybe an episode every two or three days when I find the time for it. And we're going to go ahead and make a pick. Get some more sticks, make a sword, maybe a shovel. And let's go ahead and make an axe too. And then we'll go ahead and place these where they need to be. And uh, let's go. So I don't really have food so I won't be able to sprint. I'll probably uh, get some food and stuff off camera. But let's see which way we were going. Alright, we were going this way. So I'm going to go ahead and take down the coordinates of spawn and so I know where that is. Because that looks like it might be the place that we build in. But uh, we spawn in a forest here. So uh, I'm not really sure how big this forest is. We can probably get up on top of this tree and look. And it looks like it goes into a savanna over here. So we'll go check that out. And it, I think I see a desert kind of right in that area over there. And it looks like the forest goes over there. A little river separating it. The 1.7 generation has like, it seems like the biomes are separated using rivers. So uh, that's pretty cool. We got some sheep here, so I'm going to go ahead and kill them so we can make a bed when nighttime comes around. Should really be using shears, but uh, we do not have the iron. But I'm playing on normal, so I think when my hunger goes all the way down, I'll only go down to five hearts if I'm right. Maybe it goes down to half a heart, I'm not sure. If it goes down to half a heart, we might be dying this episode. 
and it looks like this savanna spreads out quite a bit and the desert goes off on the edge of it but it looks like there's a mountain over here I uh I wish I could sprint but another river separating this it looks like and let's see how many hearts I go down from this I'm not really sure I don't really play uh vanilla minecraft much this is kind of something new to me um, we're gonna go up on this hill up here and see what we can find I'm getting a few lag spikes because the world gen is generating and it looks like it goes below five hearts so let's hope it doesn't kill me looks like we have another forest over there and we have about maybe th two or three minutes left in the day I'm not I don't really know how to tell the sun time much but it looks like this savanna keeps stretching out that way so let's go off to the left over here this is gonna make it kind of a risky uh, journey with only half a heart maybe we can find some food and eat without cooking it I don't really like to like uh, kill all the cows and stuff without um without them being like cooked or having a farm so we can re like uh multiply them like I don't really want to go and kill the animals they'll all be gone from the world but we got some horses right there so that's pretty cool uh wolves and it looks like night time is about to come around so that tells me I think I started this episode a little late but we're gonna go ahead and make a bed but um yeah I'm not really very experienced with the commentating and uh throw that seed out there's a cool little mountain over there and this looks like it goes into a plains and it looks like this forest kind of wraps around donkeys that's nice to know there's a whole bunch of donkeys there actually and yeah this goes right into a forest so my guess is we will use these forests for uh, wood and whatnot and we'll probably build over where that uh spore spawn is oh, oh I thought I was gonna die there it's kind of a risky jump but I'm really not being too safe right now so let's go ahead and make a bed or uh, place this bed down for the mob spawn because I would really not like to die on the first uh the first episode so I'm gonna go ahead and break that bed because I don't really care if I die uh, it looks like this plains biome keeps going over there I'm not really sure what that's gonna lead into but we'll leave it be for now more horses Horses actually seem to be fairly uh, common in the new uh, update. But I should be killing these pigs, but you know, I'll focus on that later. We're just going to try and find a place to build. We have a roofed forest, I think that is here, right? These are the, f yep, 4x4 four four, or 2x2 two two trees. So that's good to know. I really like the. Uh, the dark oak wood the dark oak logs I think they're called so that's nice to know that we have this biome over here and we kinda got it all we got the acacia we got this dark wood regular forest so uh, seems like this uh, world's generating pretty nicely and hold on sorry I was getting a call from Skype but it looks to me this is either a it looks like a swamp it's a big river though I was thinking it's gonna be an ocean so we'll go ahead and turn around don't really want to go into a swamp we'll go off this way a little bit looks like there's a more uh, dark oak no not dark oak um roofed forests I'm still getting used to the biome names so uh, but uh, here's that river separating the biomes like we got plains here and roofed forest over there so uh, it kind of looks like this goes off into a uh, a what you want to call it a uh, ocean 
but let's see if we can get up on top of one of these trees and uh, try and find out what kind of biomes are around here. We've kind of hit it all. We've hit desert, uh, roofed forest, and there's a forest fire. <laughs> you don't really see that too much, but uh, I'm going to make sure I don't die here. Ooh, let's see what I can do. Let's see. Alright, there we go. So let's go back in this plains and uh, see what we can find. We're going to go off that way where we saw the hill. And let's get up here, see what we can see. Oh, there's actually a village over here, so we'll come check this out. This will be good for uh, food and whatnot. We'll go ahead and uh, grab all the food, I guess, right now. But uh, I'm not really sure uh, what the episode length is at right now. So, but uh, let's see if there is a blacksmith. It's a lot of villagers. It's actually a pretty big village. But yeah, I don't think I see a blacksmith. Let's look for bookcases. That's something that most people don't really do. They don't really look for the bookcases. But, uh, that's kind of weird. But I normally don't find bookcases. I don't even know if they spawn in villages anymore. But, uh, it's always worth looking. Because, uh, bookcases, they can be hard to come by. And I think we found some right here. If we could get up there. It's kind of a deformed village. But we're going to go ahead and snag these make it a little bit easier when we get around to uh, enchanting and we'll go ahead and see if we can find another vi uh, house like this if we can't this might be the end of the episode I'm not sure yet we'll go off a little bit more that way and see what we see what we find but I'm gonna go ahead and snag all these crops to uh so we can grow them back at home wherever home is. I'm not really sure where that is yet actually. But we're gonna take all of it because most likely from what I see there's not really any generation that will stick around here. So we'll go ahead and just take it all now. But uh we gotta keep this mind in mind. I'm gonna go ahead and take the coordinates. And we're gonna make sure we get all of these. The wheat or the wheat isn't very good. I'd rather have more carrots and potatoes. Wheat, ever since carrots and potatoes have been added to the game, they haven't really been a focus or wheat hasn't really been a very good crop like uh for food. Because it takes forever to grow and when you when you break it you don't even get two. Like, for example, when you break a full-grown carrot, it might give you three for the one that you planted. So, we got 18 carrots, 15 potatoes, a poisonous potato. We'll go ahead and throw that out. Just taking up inventory. We'll go throw that cobble out. And we'll actually, let's go ahead and make this wheat into bread. Because I'm not too worried about it. So, we can maybe get our hunger up, health up, and uh, be able to sprint. Uh, looks like this episode has been a little, maybe over 10, it's definitely over 10 minutes, I'm not really sure though. I didn't really know, I don't really know when I started. But it looks like this savanna, savanna biomes are very big from what I see. But we got some, oh nope, that's still savanna, I was thinking it was extreme hills. But that's actually a very big biome. More plains over here. Let's see what we can find. We'll go a little bit more th this way and then we'll go ahead and end the episode. And it looks like we have another roofed forest over here. And this isn't generating. Looks like just a hill and this plains biome keeps on going. So, uh, my guess is next episode we'll be back where we spawned. Because this is, uh, none of this is really looking appealing to me.
and it looks like this goes off into an ocean. So what I think we're going to do is we're I'm going to go ahead and end the episode now. We'll probably end up back over where we spawned at that uh, kind of arch thing. And uh, we'll go from there. I'll probably have some cobblestone. Uh, you know what? Next, we're probably, next episode, we'll probably go mining over in a cave, probably over by where we spawned. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and run back there now. But I'll go ahead and uh, get these farms set up and... I'll just do some of the boring stuff, but next episode we're going to go caving, and we'll go from there, so go ahead and like it, subscribe, tell your friends about the series, and uh, until then, I'll, I'll see you.